Sachs. Hello, she's the Sherry Sachs, um, and happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> what a perfect day to come in here and have your first official interview for Absolutely. the studio tour. Absolutely. Um, so, Sherry, you're a little bit different than a lot of the artists who have al already been in the studio tour. One, because you are relatively new to the painting world and the art um, here in Maplewood. And can you tell me just a little bit about how you feel about your quick success here in Maplewood, locally, but as well as nationally and internationally, suddenly? Well, <laughs> thank you for that really sweet introduction. Um, I got into painting um, about five years ago when I was pregnant with my first son and wanted to make him some art for his new room and started painting at that point. Then. About two years later, I started studying biology and realized my study process involved painting. Mm -hmm. And so as a way of studying biological concepts, I got some canvas and decided to paint them in processing. And this is how they were coming out. <laughs> That's it. Everybody has their own way of coming into it, right? Yeah. OK, so tell me, um, you obviously paint for yourself. and. I know that you've also been commissioned by some friends and some client, you know, local people here. Um, how do you go about deciding what you're going to paint for that person, what they're going to be attracted to, how they're going to connect? I would, for me, I would find that very stressful. So, how do you? It can go be about a little it? tricky in commissioning work because there's some freedom in painting what I want. For example, with a piece like this, or. Not And so when a client asks for something specific, I try to get color ideas and feeling about where they live and their space, but also let them know that it will be in the vein of what I do and sort of consult them along the way. And I know that you work with different mediums. And what would you say is your favorite? And can you talk a little bit about your techniques and tools? I know that this you have some that are very simple and some that are very layered. Right. Well, I started off painting in, um, in a more layered approach. As the paint would dry, I would continue and mix on the canvas and then maybe even go back later when everything has dried and continue with more layers and maybe take some paint away. And then I think as I progressed and changed and felt inspired by other things, I would feel like making something a little bit more minimal. Um, and it really depended on the mood. If I'm, I notice that if I'm feeling overwhelmed with life, I'll often create something more minimal. That's great. So you just channel that energy into something beautiful. So what is your inspiration on a regular basis? Is it just regular life? Well, music is a big inspiration for me because I come more from a sort of indie music background rather than a formal art training. Mm -hmm. And so that has served as a starting point for me in creating something despite the lack of formal education and sort of feeling empowered to make art even though I don't have an art degree. Mm -hmm. Or feeling um, okay with the idea of showing work without that training. And that comes from my, my musical background. Great. And I know that last year you were in Barcelona doing an exhibit and now you're preparing for the studio tour. What else can we expect from Sherry Beth Sachs in the near future? Well, I'm really excited about the Open Studio Tour because this is my third year, and each year has been really fun. I've met great people in the community that I didn't know. Um, in about a week, I'm going to Berkeley, California to do a small group show with a photographer friend there. Mm -hmm. And then in May, I'll be in DC doing um, a sort of mixed media event with a um, photographer and a band, sort of a pop-up art show. So bringing back the music to the actual show, that's really great. Yes. <laughs> then, then there will be this excellent studio tour in June. And in August, I'll be showing in Barcelona one more time. Okay. And then at the end of the summer, I'll be showing in Asbury that's at Hotel. Great. great. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. And continued success. Thanks, Sonia.